Throughout July, I'm in France at the Tour de France, but if I could pick one place to ride in Australia throughout the winter months, it's the Sunshine Coast. And from the 19th to the 21st of July, it's the third edition of Velothon. This year, there's been a few changes from the previous years. Significantly, every single stage, all three stages, they start from a brilliant clubhouse in Maroochydore. So get your accommodation organised early. Importantly, stages one and three, they also finish at the clubhouse. So you get to the finished line and straight into relax mode. Stage two, that finishes out at the beautiful town of Montville. But part of the package, it's all included. You get a shuttle bus from the finish back down to the clubhouse. Logistically, it's really simple. You don't need a support crew. The organisers have taken care of everything there. Get organised, get training and get ready for the climbing because it is a challenging course, but it's doable. You can take the whole experience to the next level by joining the crew from ACA, Australian Cycling Academy, Ride Sunshine Coast, which could include some key advice from Ben Kirsten. Three minutes 20, mate. It's just you three. You got over it once, keep riding. Three minutes 20, don't worry about them. Worry about him. You got over it again, let him give him what you got and you'll get him on the backside. You can win this. Back yourself. One more lap, one more hill. It was Ben Kirsten who helped guide Michael Freeberg to success at the Australian Championships. And throughout Velothon, you can experience what Michael experienced at the Road Nats. They'll take care of your food, your accommodation. They'll give you advice out on the road. They'll be your support crew. So keep it simple for yourself logistically and ride like a pro at Velothon. Stage one, it all kicks off in Maroochydore at the clubhouse. Perhaps you can begin with a coffee and a bite to eat before you head out onto the road for this 103 kilometre stage. If you like ocean views, get used to it. You'll have around about 50 kilometres or so as you head on through to Noosa, but don't be fooled, it's not all flats. It's then off to the hinterland, and this is just a prelude of the climbing to come on stages two and three. The big climb on stage one though, it's the iconic climb that's used in the Noosa Triathlon. And importantly, this will be part of the King and Queen of the Mountains measuring point. Let's see how fast you can climb. From the top of the hinterland, descend back down into Maroochydore, enjoy the clubhouse once again, and get ready for stage two. As a cyclist, this sign has a completely different meaning to what it has as a motorist. And you won't be going down, you'll be going up on stage two. It's 90 kilometres starting at the clubhouse in Maroochydore and then it's over Obi Obi. This is a climb with gradients of more than 20%. Once you get to the top, this will be the sign that you go past, then it's 16 kilometres to the finish line. Montville, and this is the destination for the end of stage two. To give you a flavour of the terrain, if this was a Tour de France stage, I'd be tipping Julian Alaphilippe to win. And like the Tour de France, we're expecting some good crowds here at the finish line. Once you do arrive, relax in the park. There'll be plenty of food for you to be able to eat. But take a stroll along the street as well before then getting in the bus to head back down to Maroochydore, into the clubhouse and refuelling, because don't forget, stage three is still to come. The third and final stage, starting and finishing at the clubhouse in Maroochydore, and it's the longest of the lot, 137 kilometres. The good news is, it's Mother Nature showing off. The Glasshouse Mountains, they provide the backdrop, and as the name suggests, there's lots of climbing. Sure, it's not the mountain passes of the Pyrenees or the Alps, but if you were to compare this to one of the big one-day races in Europe, this is the Liège, best on Liège, of the Sunshine Coast. It is up and down all day long. The reward awaits, though, when you get back to Maroochydore. And for those of you who have completed all three stages, there's the finishers medal. Enjoy the ride. This is Cotton Tree Park in the heart of Maroochydore. And for Velothon 2019, it's home base. This is where the clubhouse will be. Every stage will start here and probably with a coffee before you head out onto the road. You can also put your gear in the clubhouse so you don't have to worry about that while you're riding. Each stage will also have you back here for the finish where you can replenish from the many food stalls that will be available, plus rehydrate with some of the locally produced beer. There's entertainment, courtesy of some live music, or telling the stories amongst yourselves about how well the ride went. Plus, there'll be highlights of the Tour de France, and I'll try and cross to you in July from the Tour as well. Enjoy your riding on the Sunshine Coast. It doesn't get any better than riding your bike here.